Alright, son, we're about to go, alright? So make sure you watch over your sister. You're in charge while I'm gone. I'm in charge! Yeah, I, I guess so. Um, The food is in the refrigerator, so you make sure y'all eat, alright? Alright, love you all. Have fun! See you later. Don't have too much fun. Hey, don't burn my house down. They left me in charge? That means I'm the grown up and she does whatever I say! <laughs> go get in the shower now! No! Lost your dang mind now. What could she have possibly did for you to think you could do that to your sister? Shh, shh, shh. Spit it out! Yeah, go ahead, spit it out and tell him! Shh, shh, shh. I didn't take a shower and I told him that mommy never makes me get in the shower that early. Boy, turn around. Wait, 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 I have a good explanation. Turn around. Dad, I can explain. Please don't. Five. One. Four. Dad, if I get the one, that's gonna be your behind. Fine! And you don't have to tell me what to do. I already know. <laughs> Casey, would you like to get him back? Wait, what, Mom? No! Your mom don't mind if I do. Here you go, Casey. You're gonna need this. Alex. Casey, give him another one. Here we go! Okay, okay, I'm learned! Good! Now you need to remember that you never put your hands on a girl and you never put your hands on your sister. Nor do you use a belt or anything else just in case you get any ideas. We're her parents, not you. Got it? I'm sorry I gave you a whooping, Casey! Nope, close your eyes and come to the 
trick. I know that trick. Most people that get surprises, the people bring the surprise to them. They don't go to the surprise. It's a big surprise. Come. I don't know. I've seen this on a movie before. You better not go in that Are you tricking us? Close your eyes. Tell us you give us permission to leave. I give you permission. And see, it's not a trick. It's not a trick. Permission to do what? Permission to close your eyes and come to the living room. All right. That's all you have to say.
take myself out because I could never get grades like that. Yeah, I'm glad because if my brother got grades like that. in a minute.
less than me. Exactly, so I have more space than you. You have more S than me. That's okay, so what? And you have more A's than me. That doesn't make you any better than okay, me. Okay, so do you need help or what? I do not need help. I just said that. Now leave me alone. You don't have to yell at me. You have to yell at me like that. stupid self. You're stupid. You're stupid. Why? You're dummy. You're stupid. You don't know how to do any work. You don't know how to count. Okay, okay, you don't know how to break your teeth. You always come out with your teeth stinking. That's why you can't yeah. find a boyfriend. I don't care about a boyfriend because I have good grades. So I don't care about you because you smell bad. to your brother because he got an F okay so what if he got an F that don't give you the right to talk about him yeah but if I got an F he would talk about me so I'm gonna talk about him you don't know what he would do because you ain't never had an F before okay he's never got an A so that's enough because you starting to get a little too smart at the mouth well obviously you want me to be like him and be not so smart at the mouth said that's enough now you cut your brother some slack because we don't judge nobody in this house but mom you said if we pass then we get to go to Six Flags. If we fail, we have to go to Grandma's house. And you think that gives you a reason to be mean to him? But that's a punishment. Bullying somebody and punishing them is not the same thing. Plus, you sure want to see your grandma. So obviously, you're bullying him too if he's getting punished for it. I just said they're not the same thing. Now, I'm done going back and forth with you. You go get up and you're going to go and apologize to him now. Hey, look. I'll cover your ears or you ain't going to Six Flags. Fine, now I'm covered. Did you hear what I said? Yes, I heard you. Okay, so get up and go do it. Wait, what did you say? I said go and apologize to your brother because at the end of the day, you ain't got nobody but him. So go now. Going. Zaki. Layla, if you're coming out here to call me dumb, I get it, okay? I wasn't going to call you that. Okay, fine. Well, if you're coming to call me stupid, okay, I get it. I wasn't even going to call you that either. Hey, what do you want? Just coming to apologize and say I'm you? Coming to apologize? Do you think me I'm a fool? I know I'm dumb, but okay, I know you're not going to apologize to me. I'm fine. Zaki, I'm sorry for being mean to you because you got bad grades. Okay, okay, let me, wait, let me try it again, let me try it again. Zaki, I'm so sorry that you got back. Wait, no, that didn't come out right. Okay, Zaki, Zach. What? I'm sorry that I was being mean to you earlier. Okay, I accept your apology. Okay, and do you want to play with the science stuff with me? I thought you said I wasn't smart enough to use those things. You're, you're, you're not, but, okay, wait a minute, mommy said be nice, okay. You, you're smart. I can help you. I can even help you study for your, your classes. I don't care to get good grades, Layla. Okay, well, I can help you not burn down the house and go and play with the science stuff. Are you sure you want a dumb old person like me to come and play with you? Yeah, I can't get rid of you, so might as well.
Hey kids, I hope y'all know what today is. <laughs> Are y'all ready to know what y'all grades is? Yeah, I'm ready, Mommy. Go ahead, read them. All right, so Layla, you got an A in math, an A in social studies, an A in science, a B in gym. <gasps> Zachary, you got a B in math, a B in social studies, a A in science, a C in reading, and an A in gym.
makeup. And I'm your Cyril to be, I mean, I'm Paris. So, what are y'all about to do? Play some games. Oh, I love games. Can I play with you? No. Come on, Jacob. He likes me already now. Oh, forgot to wipe. Oh, well, I'll be fine. Gonna let me play with her, her friend. Okay. Yeah. Y'all won't let me play with her and her friend. What they playing? You go in there and tell her if she don't let you play, her company going home. Oh, got it. I'm on it. Paris, why is there poop tissue hanging out your pants? Yeah. Seven in the morning. You're never up. Because of my back, I couldn't sleep. I'm just tossing and turning. I've been tossing and turning on. It's good. It is. You like that one better than a lemon ginger? Yeah, definitely. So what's going on with your back? Man? I don't know. I just got a sharp pain going up it, and then it's like something going on. I don't know. Honestly, it just hurt. I know that much. So don't you think you should probably go to the doctor for it? For what? What they gonna do? Give me some medicine and send me on my way? I'm not doing that. So did you at least take anything? No, I'm not gonna take nothing. I'm just gonna let it fix itself and I'm gonna enjoy my tea. Tea doesn't solve everything. Tea gonna solve this problem. <laughs> okay. 
I really think you should just go to the doctor, bro. You know, people who go to the doctors, they give them some excuse as to why, you know, they can just go back home and they give them some medicine, go home for a couple of days, and it turn up that it's something else. Exactly. So don't you think you should go get it checked out? No. The last time my grandpa went for a back problem, it turned out he got cancer. So they're not going to tell me I got cancer. Yeah, but wouldn't you want to know from early? You think I want to know I got cancer? Yeah, but wouldn't you rather know? No, I don't. I'd rather not know and just find out when I find out. You gonna find out if you don't go, babe. I don't know. I find out when I find out. When I get there, I get there. Right now, I'm gonna deal with the problem at hand. You back. don't know the problem. Though. My back is the problem. Exactly. So go get your back. No, check. I'm not. You want me to pay for it? No, I got my own money. I don't want you to pay for it. I don't want to go. It's not you whose back hurt. It's my back. You're not the one who they're gonna tell you got foot cancer because your back hurt. They're gonna tell me that. I'm just trying to help you out, bro. Okay, well, don't. Can you at least consider it? I'll think about it. Oh, my back is killing me. Let me just... Oh! Oh! Oh, my God. Something right. just can't be right. Maybe I should just listen to him. Let me see what doctor they got to go. I don't want no woman touching me. I want a man. I want a nice, strong man. Is this... Uh, I don't know. Yeah, I'm gonna get him to do this. Hello. Hey, how can I help you? Hi, um, I'd like to set an appointment with whoever is on your Google pictures. Oh, are you talking about Ryan? Yes, yes, Ryan. Can I get Ryan to um do my massage, please? Alright, let me check his schedule real quick. Okay, I'll be waiting. It seems we have one for five. Is that okay with you? Five o'clock today? Yes, ma'am. Yes, I can do five o'clock today. Okay, can I get your name and number? Yes, my number is 804-223-9275. And your name? Jessica. Okay, Jessica, I see you're on five. Wait, I do have a question. Is he like gentle or is he like, how, did, how does... He's able to adjust to all his customers. Adjust to all his customers, that's what I like to do. What was that, ma'am? No, I didn't say nothing. I said, all right, I'll see you at five o'clock. Okay, thank you, ma'am. Have a nice day. Some Ryan today. Oh, oh, oh. Hey, sweetie. Hey, baby, how you doing? Doing better? <laughs> Not really, but I did make an appointment. You did? Yeah. For the doctor, we're going to. No. Not going to the doctor, stop asking. I'm going to get a massage first. That's good. Yeah. Are you scared? I need to call the medicine. I need to be scared. So, how can you not scared to go tell a missus, but you scared to go to the doctor? I don't know. I'm just, you know, I don't think I'd be. Scared to see this. They got good food. Good food. Good food. Good food. Oh no, this this one is not out of shack. Take their food. Nobody. What time you gotta go? Five o'clock today. You know you gotta go in about an hour. Yeah, I know. Oh, I'm gonna keep track of my time. Mm -hmm. You should. You need to be worried about your phone. Yeah, I'm going at five o'clock today, and I cannot wait to go. What What are you doing? Finishing up some emails. Got about maybe. Three or four more emails. So how late do you think you'll be working? Four o'clock. Maybe till it's four thirty. Four o'clock. I just told you it's four o'clock. Okay. I think I got time to get dressed. You think I should do my makeup? You gotta get dressed. Why you put on makeup? You know you're gonna be laying flat. I'm gonna really wear makeup like this, so. I, I, I. You know, Mrs. Is, is I'm telling you. On my stomach, so they don't see my face. No. So they, the person that's doing it, they not gonna know me. Yeah, but they're not going to see my face. They're going to... No. Yeah. I don't know. No, you know what they're telling me? No, I haven't, but you know what? It's, I'm just so going to... Basically, when you go, they're going to put you in for the nice part, and you basically get a little towel. Yeah. Like that. Like, it might be hot or it might be cold. Okay. You know how they do it. Okay, don't, don't tell me. I just want to be a surprise. So I'm going to get dressed. What do you think I should wear? Should I wear a dress? 
Like what? Like some slides and leggings? Like some slides and some sweats. So you want to look like I'm not put together? Hey, you're getting a massage. You're not going out to a dinner. Yeah, but I'm just not seeing this person. I got to make a good first impression because I might be going back. I don't want you to think I'm not. You know it's a whole bunch of people. They probably don't even speak our language. They're not going to know what you're saying. You're right, Mom. I'm gonna get you a second. I'll see you later. Right, good girl. We'll finish up this second. Ah, I'm gonna check oh, it on you, okay? Mm, yeah, thanks. I like this dress. Okay, we're gonna go with this dress and then the bracelet. Yes, the bracelet matches. I actually like the bracelet. It goes with the first with the silver. So we're gonna do. Okay, I cannot wait to see Ryan because he's so cute. All right, babe, I'm about to go, okay? Wow, you look. I, was, I, I gotta go to my appointment. I'll see you later. Jessica? That's me. Okay, come on, follow me. All right, right this way, ma'am. Go ahead and have a seat on this table for me, please. Excuse me, honey. Woo. So, how's your day today? My day's been going great, actually. Besides my back, but yeah. So, it sounds like I already know what you're coming here for. Mainly just your back? Yes. Okay, That's so. That's it, nothing else. Just that. Okay, so normally we do full body massages for our customers, mm -hmm. but since you mainly just wanted back problems and stuff, mm -hmm. we're just gonna focus on your back for today. Okay, that's fine. No, wait, is there a problem? No, no, it's no problem. I just didn't know you offer full body massage. Oh, well, the guy up front was no, the kid you. up front did not tell me that. Well, yeah, he's just new. He's working here because it's summer, so it's just like an intern. It's okay. And so you ain't got it. But explain just so you know, for next time, you yeah. can go ahead and come in yeah. here and I'll give you a full yeah. body massage. Or if you decide to go to somebody else, then they'll somebody else. Okay. Yeah. Uh, go ahead and lay down for me. Let's go ahead and all see right. how your back feels. I'm going to look for the tenseness in your back. All right. And then I have a question what you was talking about the next time. Oh, go ahead, ma'am. Do you allow your customers to come back work once whenever they want to, like any day? Bi-weekly. The reason I say bi-weekly, like I tell all my other customers, is just because if you guys come in every week, I'm putting so much pressure on your back that it's not going to feel comfortable like it's supposed to when you come in for a massage. It's going to start feeling uncomfortable because oh. I'm doing it too many times. The, the tits. Exactly. You understand. Some people don't understand. They get mad at me, but I'm glad you understand. Yeah, I totally understand that. I'm not mad at you. So for now, I'm just going to focus on your upper back. I'm oh, going to okay. see how your upper back is feeling as far as tenseness, okay? Okay. So you do seem a little tense up here. Ooh. So I can see what you've been complaining about. Let's see what you're mid about. You said middle back or was it the up, the bottom? It's the mid back okay. right here. Like right here? Yeah. Okay, let's see. Oh, yeah. Well, um, so normally when people come into me for massages, they're never this tense. Mm -hmm. I really think you should probably go to a doctor maybe and okay. get this checked Excuse out. Me. Excuse me. Excuse me. Is there a problem? Huh? I didn't come here for you to give me doctorate advice. No, I wasn't giving you advice. I'm just No, you told me to go to the, I didn't come for your suggestions. Okay, I came you. for a massage. I'm tired of everybody telling me to go to the doctor and then the doctor go tell me something else. Do I know you? Rivercrest High School. You graduated in 2014, right? Yes. You don't remember me, Ryan? No, nope, I do not remember you. I didn't even notice you from your Come on, bro. Ryan McBrien. Remember I wore the big goggles in chemistry class? Nope, Ryan McBrien. You don't remember that? Mm-mm. Okay, I know how you're going to remember me. I blew up that thing in the school. I remember now. Why didn't you say you got some soft hands? Why didn't you say that, Ryan McBrien? You already said that to me. I recognized you when you kind of lashed out on me just now because you used to always do that in I, chemistry class. I did not do that, Ryan. How you been? I've been great. How about you? I've been pretty good. So how's your wife? My wife? Yeah. You know wife over here, sorry. Girlfriend? No. Oh. I'm kind of just focusing Kids. on myself. Kids! No! I'm kind of just focusing on myself right now. Well, I don't mean to come off rude. I don't have a problem having a girlfriend or anything, but I don't have one as of right now. But since you're asking me that, I'm guessing you have a husband? Me? A husband? No, no husband in this picture. Come on now, what about that dude you dated the whole high school semester? You remember him? Yes! Wasn't that his name like Charlie or something like that? Mm-mm. Nah. Y'all not together no more? Nope, me and Charlie are not together. Anymore. So are you with anybody? Well, me and Charlie kind of do got this little on and off thing going on. You know, that's about 
love it though, but we're not like it. It's not what? That's not what I want to do. But I, no, we're not like in a relationship, but we're not like you know, it's a situation shit. Let's call it that. So you basically free. You said it. I didn't. Mm-hmm. So you wouldn't mind if I took you out on a date, would you? All right, I'm just gonna go ahead and hang out. Wait, did I say something wrong? No, have a nice day. Hey, is this Jessica? It's Ryan. Ryan? Ryan, how did you get my name? Hello? Hello? She must got bad connection. Hello? He really likes me. Ryan, how did you get my number? Um, I looked on the sign and she... Look, I know it's wrong, but I just couldn't help myself. <laughs> Ryan, you're so sweet. So I was just wondering, like, are you available for a date? I'm not available. Hold on, let me check my calendar. Okay, well... Yeah, I'm available. I checked it. Yeah, I'm free tomorrow. And the day after that, anytime. It doesn't even matter. I really prefer 3 o'clock. 3 o'clock is... What's that? Hello?
Wait, Tommy, break down how it's so white. Are you wanting to get a whooping or do you want me to get a whooping?
never let me see you do that again. Stand on the stand. Can you just get out while I'm in? Now, can you please come with me? Please, don't do anything. I'm begging you. Please. Anything? If, if we get caught, you can blame me. I always come do when I get in now, trouble. Please. Cairo. Do we go? Cairo. Cairo. Do you want to go? Come on, let's just go.
know. Okay, go ahead. Okay, how long is it going to take? Five seconds for 
watching the video so I know what to do. Get up. 
bother him. One eensy weensy bit. Hold on, bro. 
and if I have to say that again to you, I really don't get a piece of my life. Yeah, I said I'm let you off, give me the rest of that boy. What's that? No, no, no. What is that y'all watching while y'all supposed to be eating? Nothing, mom. It's just a TikTok video. It's just a video. It's just a what? It's just a video on TikTok. If you wanted to see it, it's pretty funny. You I want to see it to you later. Me? I said it to her later. Later? Yes, here. Just switch plates with me. Okay. Well, if I cut you, talk to your sister like that one more time. Sorry, Mom. You're just being annoying. Ow! Where's my money at? What the money for? The money that you're supposed to give me in the room. Give it here. What the money for? I only got my hundred dollars. Hey, Mommy, do you want to Okay, fine. So give me the Give me my Downstairs now. What, mommy? I said downstairs now. Oh, okay. Excuse me. I gotta go and talk to my mommy real quick. Better not say anything. Okay, mommy, I'm here. What do we have to talk about? So I know I talked to you about the chores that I need you to do. The chores? What, what chores? You know exactly what chores I'm talking about. The same chores I've been telling you to do for the last two weeks that you have yet to do. No, yeah, but I need you to remind. The one where you were supposed to scrub the floor. Did you forget? Yeah. Upstairs and do 
Like I told her to come up here and scrub this floor. She told you to come up here and scrub the floor. She sure did. And when she said $20, that's all she had to tell me to do it. I don't know who 20 Where did she even get $20 from? I don't know. You should probably ask her. Where's she at? In her room, I think. In, in her room over here. Bragging with all her money. Bra bragging to who? She ain't supposed to have her phone. The girl ain't did her chores in about two weeks. Hmm. That's what I tried to tell her. You know what? Keep scrubbing. Rock em. Sock em. Put him in a chokehold. Rock em. Uh-huh. 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 No, I'm, I'm telling you. When I was walking by his door, it just happened to him. And he was like, I pushed that boy in the locker. And then I took his money. Guess who it was? It was little Jibu. you want them to do. I guess I did blackmail him, but, but that's because he was being a bully and I wasn't being a bully. You don't even know if my store was true. I was just working on my talent skills. Punishment for a week. Punish me? Punish what? Well, yeah, that's what you get. <laughs> I told you to stay out my room, you goof off. <laughs> and you want punishment for two weeks. What? Ah! What do I get double the time she gets? Because of what, because of what you did to the boy. Exactly, because of what you did to little Jabo. Yeah, but nobody even has 
you got that money, don't you? I mean, yeah, I do have that money, but oh, don't you worry, because you won't have that money for too long. So I have to give it back to him? Okay, okay, so if I give it back... Whoa, whoa, wait. If you have to give it back, that means that I have to give it back to... Do I have to give it back to him? Yeah, you gotta give it back, and you can start now. Give it to me. Here. Mom, this isn't all of the money. Give me the other $80. Here. Thank I need more. I need six more dollars. You can't hear? Oh no, you must have the wrong house. So what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna close my eyes, I'm gonna count to seven. Um, that's a weird number. I didn't ask you that, stranger. Now like I said, I'm gonna count to seven and you should be gone. One, two, four, five, six, yeah, I'm not going seven. Down. You're still here? I'm staying here forever and ever. I'm never. Okay, now you did this on our own. Our nice sister tried to <gasps> stop us. You storyteller, we did it right there! I know, but mommy doesn't. Who is she gonna believe? Her sweet new kid or her old too jealous kid? Okay, now you wait just one minute. I'm not old. Wait, well, look, that's all you have to say? Well, and I'm not jealous. You're forgetting something. What else? We didn't do this? Yeah, we didn't do this. <sighs> You two are boring me. If they were boring, she's kind of funny. <sighs> New girl in the house that claims she's our sister. What cereal did you dump all over the couch? Uh, the nastiest one, Fruit Loops. Can't you tell? I kind of like her because <laughs> she's right. Who picks that cereal by choice? Yeah, you're laughing, right? But it also looks like she did something with your Rice Krispie treats, too. <laughs> That's because I did. What? Did you do? Uh, I left you a Christmas present in the bathroom for the both of you. Bathroom? For the both of us? This can't be done! What did you do? If you really want to know, then I'll tell you. First, I started off by... Add a little bit of this and a little bit of that. Um, a little bit. And that's how I made your Christmas present. So do you like it? <laughs> 